happens. Look what Tiger Woods went through. I mean, come on. It's no mystery why these white women are jumping at these black males. It's for an economic payday. And you know what's sad? The black males know that the white women are only dating them for the money. They know it. And they still go into these relationships. Every other week you see a black athlete marrying a white woman who would have never even looked at him if it wasn't for the pocketbook. You know, so for me, I have nothing against the white female. But as someone who loves the black family, who wants to see my people thrive, survive and succeed, I cannot support interracial marriage because we're supposed to be building families in the black community. Black on black love. What's wrong with black on black love? Charity starts at home. And if you can't make a woman with a if you can't make a family with a black woman, then there's no need for you to consider yourself part of the black community. Can you be pro black if you married to a white woman? And can you be pro black if you biracial? OK, l let me take the second question. Can you be pro black? And I hate the word pro black, but can you be pro black if you mix race? Of course you can. I don't take any issue with the mixed race African. For me, it's a two pronged test. Number one, are you biologically African? Are you the direct descendant of African people? Do you have a black parent? If you do and you identify with the race, I accept you as a brother or sister, no different than anybody else. So for me, there's no issue for mixed race Africans. Many of my heroes were mixed race Africans. You see, it's even been suggested that the great Nat Turner might have been a mixed race African. Bob Marley was a mixed race African. Booker T. Washington was a mixed race African. So we don't take issue with that because we're not responsible for how we got here. And our mothers on the plantation had no control over who decided to rape her that night. You understand? So we do not reject the children. If you identify though, that's the key. Cause you do have mixed race Africans who say, I'm not black. You know, I'm multicultural. I'm multiracial. If they come with that nonsense, I reject them. Because what you're telling me is you don't want to be in with us. You understand? So if they are coming with any ideology or identity other than black African, so be it. You don't want to be a part of this. No problem. I'm not trying to claim you. Go on your way. But if you say, listen, I'm black. I know I'm black. Yes, my mama is white. Yes, my daddy might be white, but my you know, my, my, my mom is black. My dad is black. I'm black. I've been black my whole life. I know that's how the world sees me. That's how I see myself. Get in where you fit in. I have no issue. I don't care if you light, bright, blue, black, purple. I don't care if you got green eyes or black eyes, nappy hair or curly hair. It don't make a difference to me. If you got the blood of Africa in you and you identify with us, I make no differences amongst us.